What about bacteria? You hear abscess, you think infection. Is that the main driver? That's the million dollar question, really. It's still debated. You definitely find bacteria in HS lesions, common ones like Staph aureus, Strep, others like Proteus, and anaerobes too. But is it chicken or egg? Did the bacteria cause it, or did they just move in once the inflammation started? Exactly. It's not clear if they're the primary cause or more like secondary invaders that make the existing inflammation worse. And what about those samples from lymph nodes after surgery? Does that shed any light? It suggests bacteria are definitely involved in the chronicity. When they look at lymph nodes draining the affected areas, they often find things like Staph epidermidis, Corynebacterium, sometimes less common ones like Klebsiella or Enterococcus. This supports the idea that bacterial superinfection in existing lesions helps keep that chronic inflammation going. The source has also mentioned something I didn't expect a link to periodontitis, gum disease. Yeah, it's surprising, right? Cool.